You never know when you're going to fall in love. You just are minding your own business, and I clearly fell in love with penguins. It's a love affair that began more than 40 years ago, when Dr. D. Borsma first traveled to the Galapagos Islands in Ecuador to study its penguin population. Everybody likes penguins, or at least I think almost everybody does. They're comical, they walk upright, uh, we identify with them, and they're really interesting. And like their fellow sentinel creatures, penguins are also extremely helpful in sounding the alarm about environmental hazards, like pollution, overfishing, and climate change. Dr. Borsma regularly travels to Ecuador and Argentina to continue to study their penguin populations and the messages they convey. They really are wonderful reflectors of environmental conditions. We think of them as sentinels, meaning like the canaries in the coal mine. So this is how it works in the, in the field. We have but these, what good uh, is sounding an alarm if yeah, no one's listening? Dr. Borsma and her team at the UW Center for Ecosystem Sentinels have compiled decades of research about the penguin's lifestyles and environment. When penguins walk across the scale... But in an age of overwhelming information and limited attention spans, she realized scientists like herself must not only write and speak about their research... Wildlife is telling us the state of our planet but also show it to the general public through the power of video, letting the penguins speak for themselves. If penguins are telling you this, it might, you might pay more attention to it than if a person actually tells you about it. Which is why she now offers a course called Science Communication to teach biology students about storytelling and video editing. Penguins are very photogenic and characteristic, and so having the video platform to do that allows us to tell their powerful message in a short period of time. And so it's like going through a toll booth. So Dr. Borsma and her team continue to work with the penguins, like devising easier, safer ways to measure their weight, and learning how to track their age through the coloration of their feet. My hope is that my students will change the world and make it better. Um, for people, but in particular for penguins and other sentinel species. It's all part of a never-ending mission to demonstrate how environmental problems affect all of us and how humans can help. With these sentinel species, you can alert people to some of these problems and we can do better. And thanks in part to the work happening here, she is more hopeful than ever. Because we can make a difference for these other creatures in the world and it will enrich our lives. <laughs>